Hey guys, it's been a long time since I made a Jeep video, so uh, I thought I'd show you something I'm working on here. You know, my uh, my CJ2A is still a 6-volt system, a generator, and I have no desire to change that. Um, but I have kind of wanted to have a way to keep my cell phone charged, maybe uh, plug in a GPS. And I found out about this little uh, power converter uh, that converts... Uh, from 6 volt up to 12 volt in order to charge a small small thing like the cell phone. So I picked one up. I'm going to show you this. This is uh, it's a little unit here. It's about $14 on Amazon. Uh, it's really cheap and it's pretty simple. Um, so I was going to show you what I've got set up here and then I'm going to go ahead and put it in. So um, as you can see I've kind of got it wired up here already and I've got a uh, a outlet here it's going to mount on the dash that has both a cigarette lighter and two usb ports on it and then i've got the wiring set up here to hook up to it so here's a, a really crude diagram of how i'm going to hook it up um, <clears throat> so i'm basically going to use the ignition switch power is going to come in the ignition switch and i'm going to connect it up to the accessory terminal so it's on either when the when the jeep's running or in the accessory position and then it'll go through a fuse up to the converter and then over to the uh, to the unit that mounts under the dash, and um, then this just shows the wiring, then back down to a ground, which I'll ground up underneath the dash. So it's pretty simple, uh, pretty simple wiring. So I've got it put together. I've already kind of test fitted it, and I've also have after I wired it up, I just hooked it up to the battery and tested it out, and make sure it does in fact charge my cell phone, which it does. It works works fine. So <clears throat> I'm. I've got the uh, the place set to mount this under the dash, and um, I'm going to put this up uh, behind the dash, and then hook this up to the uh, to the to the uh, ignition switch, and then I've got a screw uh, I've identified. I'm going to go ahead and set up to ground it. So it's pretty simple. So uh, I'm going to get work on this, and I'll get back to you when uh, once I get it uh, installed. Hey guys, I'm back, and I've got the uh, power converter installed in the Jeep. Uh, so let's come over and take a look at it. It was uh, pretty pretty straightforward. Um, so I've got the the outlets mounted down here with a cigarette lighter type outlet so I can use the GPS and the dual USB ports here. So it's wired up, tapped off the ignition switch, and I mounted the converter just up behind it on the crossbar up there. And uh, so it's it's pretty straightforward. So I turn it on. Just turn the Jeep on. Turn the ignition on. Got a little blue LED light comes on, tells me it's on, and come over here and look at this device, and it is now charging. So that's what I wanted, just to be able to charge my uh, phone or the GPS or whatever. Uh, and it's got, uh, say, two USBs and the um, and the cigarette lighter, but the output is only three amps uh, out of it. So you got to watch what you can't you know, overload it too much. But uh, but for what I want to do, it's it's just fine. Uh, that serves my purpose and it was pretty easy to install and uh, I mean the uh, the converter was about $14 off of Amazon and the outlet here was a uh, 10 or $12 from uh, O'Reilly Auto Parts and the rest was just simple wire and put it together so it's a pretty easy upgrade to do for you guys that still have six volt systems um, sure make uh, give you give you the option of keeping your stuff charged so Anyway, just wanted to share that with you. Hope you like it. Uh, all right, I'll talk to you all later. Bye.